This video app review is brought to you by the iPhoneAppReview.com. Hey everyone, Sarah Hanlon here with the iPhoneAppReview.com, and today we're taking a look at pulse oximeter, which is a great app for measuring blood oxygen levels. It's available to download for $3.99 from the App Store. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how it works. There could be a number of reasons why you'd want to get an accurate measurement of your heart rate and blood oxygen levels, primarily health. Uh, if you're an athlete, you like to keep tabs on stuff like this. Pulse oximeter is a great way to go. And just as a disclaimer, it's not intended to actually replace doctor visits or, you know, actual uh, pulse oximeter hardware. It's just an app. Um, always keep that in mind whenever you're using apps that somewhat so serve a medical purpose. It's just an app, and it definitely does not replace an actual doctor. So, technicalities aside, pulse oximeter uses uh, your iPhone's camera and flash to get a reading of your heart rate and oxygen levels. When you first open up the app, you go through a few uh, basic tutorial screens that kind of show you how to start using the app. And once you get through that, you're taken to this screen, which is the main screen, and it is where you will do your reading. And as you can see, you press start to begin and once you press start let's see if we can get it going press start and you cover the flash and camera lens with your fingertip and after a few seconds what you'll do is you will see a reading and it shouldn't take too long make sure you're covering the lens and flash all the way and you can see there's your reading you can see your beats per minute and your blood oxygen level we'll go ahead and we'll do it again Normally the reading should only take a few seconds to come up. And one thing that's worth mentioning is, as with most um, Pulse apps and other apps like Pulse Oximeter, you can't really use it with a phone case, if you're familiar with OtterBox and how chunky they are. Most of them uh, keep you from putting your finger completely flat against the back of the iPhone, which is what you need to do. You need to cover both the flash and the camera lens. One thing that Pulse Oximeter does show you is it keeps a log of all of your measurements and what you can do is if you swipe over you can add labels to your log. So we'll say we were working. Um, one of the things that I would like is custom notes because you're only limited to essentially the labels that are built into the app. And if you like to take your heart rate and blood oxygen level measurements before medication or after medication, etc., doing different activities, you're not able to do that as of right now because you're limited to these labels so definitely custom labels and or notes that can be added to your log would be fantastic and also there's an options menu where you can see instructions how it works terms of use etc again pulse oximeter is available to download from the app store for $3.99 and is designed for iPhone this has been Sarah Hanlon with the iPhoneAppReview.com taking a look at pulse oximeter. Till next time.